PMWeb is an incredibly functional and versatile software, but when overlaid with WalkMe, can be enhanced in some exciting ways, including simplifying user onboarding, increasing data integrity, expediting complex or repetitive processes, or providing easy access to company documents and resources. Let's take a look at how WalkMe can provide some of those benefits. In terms of user onboarding, WalkMe can be helpful because here in our Need Help menu, we can create line items that represent tasks that a user would experience while going through their training. These tasks can be scrolled to be found, organized in whatever way makes the most sense, or searched. So let's say I'm a new user and I've just gone through training and I need to create a budget, but I don't remember how. I can start typing for budget and here's a line item. As soon as I click it, I get step-by-step -step instructions on screen showing me exactly what to click on, where to go, and what to do. And this training, this on this onboarding can be used while in training and then is still accessible to the user in the live environment once they've completed their training. If I accidentally close out, we can put buttons here to make that help immediately available wherever the user needs it. So in the, in the case of me maybe making it this far but forgetting where to go next, I can get the access immediately. We can customize these balloons with as much or as little information as makes sense for each process. And we can customize the paths. We can even put in variations of paths to say, oh, if a field gets filled out one way, then additional fields pop up. We can customize the guide to represent or to capture all of those. Let's say that I'm a user who has been in the system for a while, can remember how to get through most of the process, but maybe don't, don't remember what a specific field is. We can use WalkMe to provide specific guidance on fields. And what we see here is a smart tip that's explaining how to create the correct description for this particular budget request. So I have help available in the form of step-by-step -step guides, or I have help in the form of on-screen uh, tool tips. Now, WalkMe can also be used to increase data integrity by making sure the fields are filled out correctly in ways that uh, PMWeb doesn't have access to. So with PMWeb, we have certain fields that we can make required as indicated by these asterisks. But what PMWeb doesn't do is tell us very much about why those fields are required. So in some cases, what we'll see here with WalkMe is the validation can pop up when I fill in a field incorrectly and it can be told it can be set to provide us exactly guidance on why this field is incorrect. Furthermore, we can have our failure of validations trigger other features. You'll see that stop sign just appeared here. That's another walk me piece that's used to stop a user in a PM web process in a way that PM web normally doesn't have access to. And this validation can also be done conditionally with other items on screen. So if I had selected a particular type in a particular category combination, then my validation might be that this has to be above a certain number or below a certain number. So where PMWeb can make fields required, WalkMe can make them conditionally required and then do things like blocking a user from continuing on and providing them guidance as to exactly what needs to be changed and why. So with WalkMe, we've got a lot more functionality and versatility in terms of increasing data integrity and making sure the data does not get submitted um, incorrectly or poorly. Next thing we can talk about with WalkMe is expediting complex or repetitive processes. So let's say that I'm here on my home screen and I need to complete a safety form. And rather than navigate there every single time through the navigation panel, here are my need help, I can have some very easy access to these forms. And if I click create a safety form, you'll notice that my cursor won't move. I'm automatically jumped to a safety form page with a safety form guidance put directly up. So just that quickly, WalkMe can be used to provide all those functions. Let's say that we'd like to maybe make this process even easier for some users who are in the system but are not our direct employees. And as such, we cannot provide as much training for. So what I can do is use WalkMe to create this sort of easy chat feature here. And now on screen, you'll see all I'm asked is a set of questions. Uh, the questions can be customized and we can determine what sort of answers are valid or invalid. And in this case, you can see that I've hard coded 
a set of answers that mirror the drop-down list within PM Web. So I make a selection for the reporting period. Now I have the ability to type in whatever answers I need to. Let's say there's been quite a few recordable incidents. And I finally am left with an open text field. Here are all my additional notes. And at this point, you'll notice that I haven't changed where I'm at within PM Web. I've just been interacting with these very simple questions that have been asked of me. But as soon as I click OK, my cursor doesn't move. I don't touch the keyboard. And now it's Walk Me that has navigated me to this form. I, you can see that I, even though I click outside, I can only interact with the field that Walk Me is pointing me at. I'll select my project. I'll select the company. And then again, without me interacting with the form, Walk Me completes the process for me. And in this way, I don't have to know what reporting period. I could have provided extra guidance in my chat feature to make that more simple. Walk Me has filled out all these forms. Here are my additional notes. And Walk Me has guided me through this process and given me a congratulations bubble at the end to let me know that I'm ready to complete this prior or that I'm done. And finally, we have we can provide access to additional resources. So in many cases, it's beneficial to have PDF documents available, templates, Word documents, uh, training videos, or diagrams. And here in the Need Help menu, if I scroll just a bit further down, we can see I have some references. These represent different documents and templates that I have access to, or I can take a user to links. If I have an intranet site, I can link straight to that. If I want to load in videos, I can do as well. Or here at the bottom of the screen, I have a process diagram, which is available anywhere within PM Web and shows my PM Web planning. These diagrams can be customized. We can build them to look and feel however you want. And we can build multiple diagrams for different reasons. And we can make them interactive. So if I'm a user and I say, oh, this is that diagram that I'm used to seeing in my training. It's telling me exactly where I need to go next. So it's budgets. Oh, OK, well, I can click here. And now I've got the helpful guide for budgets at my fingertips, accessible from multiple places. And with that, you can see how PM Web is an incredibly functional tool. But when enhanced with WalkMe, we can expedite user onboarding. We can provide them the same sort of step-by-step -step guidance that they get in training on screen at their fingertips. We can use the validations within WalkMe to make sure the data is getting put in correctly and decrease the need to review bad or bad data or re-input. We can expedite complex processes. We can simplify complex processes. We can provide access to the documents and resources to make the business run smoothly. So WalkMe has a lot of great functionality that can add to an already powerful software within PM Web.